Hello everybody! Today I'm going to show you another simple way to create a Windows bootable USB flash drive. All you need is this tiny application and an ISO image file or a CD or DVD disk of your operating system. The software is called WinLine and has a simple and clear interface, so the whole process can be done in a few steps. Here you can choose either to use an ISO image file or a CD or DVD disk. Well, I have a Windows 7 ISO image. So I navigate to my image file. As we can see, there is no flash drive to choose. That's because it is not plugged in. So I can plug it in right now. It appears in Explorer and now we can choose the drive in WinLine. Here I have some important files on my flash drive and I want to keep it. Anyway, there is enough space to place Windows files. My drive is FAT32 and that's ok, my computer will be able to boot using a FAT32 drive, so I don't check any formatting options. Formatting the drive would erase my important data forever. And now just press Go button. The application creates a command file in a temporary folder that runs all preparing operations, makes the drive bootable and extracts Windows files. Once it is ready, we can see that my important data files are safe and still there. Yet it is now a bootable flash drive that can be used to install Windows 7. Now reboot using this flash drive and install Windows 7 as usual. Let's check how it works. I'm going to use VMware Workstation to launch a virtual machine. Choose to boot using a USB drive. Everything seems to be fine. The installation program detects the hard drive and begins the installation process. And that's it. 